Hi friends, this is Andy from Tech Store, and in this video, I'm going to be showing you the disassembly process of the base and touchpad of uh, Acer Aspire ES1 131. This is the mini 11.6 inches laptop that uh, we'll be opening up, and uh, we'll be showing you how to upgrade the RAM, hard drive, replace the battery, Wi Fi chip, the CMOS cell, as well as the motherboard of uh, this particular laptop. So, if your uh, laptop basically looks like this, and uh, the base is something like this. And once opened, it's, it's looking like this. I just mentioned a ES11 or a ES1131. Then you can apply this uh, entire process. So you need to have a screwdriver set. Uh, you need to have a prior like this, or a prior like this, and you need to have uh, this kind of a partition box uh, to keep the screws, which are of different dimensions. So, first thing you need to flip the laptop here and uh, you see all these screws over here. There are no screws hidden in the rudders, so that is one thing uh, you need to be rest assured about. There is this one sticker over here, the Acer sticker is where we have removed it. Another sticker is over here that we will remove. This is a plastic sticker, so it's very easy to remove and again fix it back. Just in a case your uh, laptop is under warranty, we request you to very carefully remove it and uh, keep it on one side all right now you need to remove all the screws that are visible absolutely the entire base will come off Alright, so now all the screws are out. Now we need to protrude the base so that it comes out. Let's take the prior and uh, start protruding it from here. Over here. Very gently. Pretty straightforward actually. And let the base will give away. So as you can see, uh, the hard drive is here, the battery is here, the motherboard is here. The RAM is uh, hidden. Uh, behind the motherboard so first thing first we need to remove the battery here for removing the battery these are the screws and then you need to remove the connector And the battery will give away. So the battery type is AC14B13J, as you can see over here. And uh, it's basically a 37.7 baht hour battery that you need to buy. Just take another battery like this, and you can replace the battery. Now coming to the hard drive here. The hard drive is uh, basically connected to this particular SATA port. So you just need to slide it on the left and just remove it like this. It's a Seagate hard drive that Acer has incorporated. It's a good thing. It's a 2.5 inches SATA hard drive that uh, this particular model has. You can just take another hard drive or an SSD and you can upgrade the hard drive. It's pretty straightforward. Now coming to the RAM here. Now the motherboard entirely has to be removed uh, for which we need to remove these strip connectors that are connecting. This is the speaker. These are the two speakers that it has. You just remove the speaker connector. Uh, you can remove the speaker. There's another wire connecting over here to the speaker. Just remove them and uh, replace it with another speaker if you want to replace the speaker. Now, this is the connector which touch connects to the touchpad. So, just remove it. And uh, there is uh, the Wi Fi chip that we need to remove. So, it's one screw and the Wi Fi chip is through. To remove the two antennas and uh, this is the Wi-Fi chip basically it's a Qualcomm Atheros uh, AC750 Mbps chip that uh, is there with it so if you want to replace the Wi-Fi chip just take a similar Wi-Fi chip and uh, replace it now coming to the motherboard here everything else is uh, very specifically removed now these are screws here which have to be removed for coming to the motherboard one 
over. And three. Before which we need to remove uh, this particular connector over here which is connecting to the LED. cable gives away and the motherboard is a free word you just need to take care of this uh, battery here and another connector over here which you need to remove for the keyboard and you can see the RAM over here so just remove this CMOS cell and the motherboard is in your hand so this is one slot here, the maximum RAM upgrade uh, capacity for this particular laptop is 8GB So one single 8GB DIMM you can put, 8GB DDR3 low voltage, 1600 MHz sodium memory is what you need to put And uh, just use your two fingers and the RAM slot is vacant and This is the RAM memory that is there Just insert it back Alright, we are good to go Now we will fit the whole things back. Alright, so this uh, video basically showed you how to replace the memory, hard drive, motherboard, battery, the Wi-Fi chip, the speakers, 
uh, of the Acer Aspire ES1131, ES11 also this model is called as. You have to buy a DDR3 low voltage memory, a 2.5 inches SATA SSD or hard drive to upgrade your uh, laptop. You have also mentioned the battery part number for replacing the battery and even the Wi-Fi chip details you have given. Hope you liked the video. Do list some of the suggestions and comments and don't forget to subscribe to us. You can buy all these components on our website techstore.co.in. Thank you so much guys.